Time for some travel fuel. Want one? Sure. Yeah, that ain't half bad. I'd always heard folks were nicer in your day. Never expected I'd see it firsthand. Well, I suppose we had it easy. I guess easier. Those nice people, they caused all of this. Uh, look, I'm sorry. Didn't mean to bring you down. We okay? Things are pretty good from where I'm standing. I'm all in. I appreciate that. I wouldn't be able to do this without you and Val. Who do you think actually won the war? Nobody, I guess. I mean, yeah. Then again, we only have our experience here. Maybe it's better elsewhere. Suppose there's no way to know. You'd be shocked how many folks I've managed to convince I'm just a really sick ghoul. Yeah, sure. Very convincing. What's the angle here? Well, we get back to the church and see if Deacon and the real world can help us. And there it is. The end of the Freedom Trail. I'll, um, do some introductions, okay? It'll be fine. They have trust issues. Deacon? Well, a friend made it back okay. But he's bald. All an act. <clears throat> Don't mind me. And the new guy patched me up, put me on his shoulder, and blasted his way through the rest of the complex. Since everywhere. He said he wouldn't risk his life for the cause. Hello, words. I'm actions. I'm speaking awfully loud. Point taken. Deacon told me you single-handedly secured Carrington's prototype, disabled a minefield, and wiped out a hundred Gen 1s. So is any of that true? You don't believe Deacon? Let's just say that Deacon and the truth aren't always on the same team. Well, it's mostly true. Let's say that. There were maybe a hundred, and Deacon was with me the whole way. Embellishing the truth again, are we? She would have fallen for it, you know? Don't flatter yourself. Still, I was expecting Deacon to grab a full team, including Glory, to secure that prototype. But instead, just the two of you cleared out the entire switchboard. You'd be insane not to sign him up, Des. You've certainly made an impression on Deacon. He's never spoken about, or lied about, anyone so highly before. Welcome to the railroad, Agent. Agent, huh? Well, look. What I was trying to say was, it wasn't just me. I had Valentine back me up, along with Piper here. She can be trusted. They both can. And if you can accept that, then I'm happy to be aboard. Help for help, right? It seems we're very lucky to have you. So you're in. Now we need to know what to call you. Secrecy keeps us alive. Code names are a part of that. So what's yours? I've never been big on code names. Got any suggestions? No. It doesn't work like that. Uh, your life, your name, your choice. All right. I used to do a little trick shooting. So, let's go with Bullseye. Well, from what Deacon says of your fighting skills, Bullseye seems apt. Your first official order is to deliver Dr. Carrington his prototype and see if he can use another pair of hands. But first, it's time to meet the rest of the gang. The location of our HQ is one of our most Need something? Let's places. talk after. I think we ought to. So be careful, coming in or out. You never can tell when you're being watched. Right. Secrecy is important. I saw what happened to the old base. I can understand you not wanting that to happen again. This is it. It may lack the amenities of the switchboard, but it's safe. And we've taken precautions not to be surprised again. Things are chaotic right now. So there's plenty for you to do. Uh, about that. There's a reason I agreed to help. I hope I can go over that with you. Listen up, everyone. This is Bullseye. He did the switchboard off with Deacon. He's a full agent, effective immediately. I'm counting on each of you to show him the ropes. Feel free to welcome him aboard. That is all. I got some schematics I was hoping you could take a look at. A scientist named Virgil said 
They could get me inside the Institute. So that's what the Courser chip was all about. You needed that frequency, I take it. Why? What does this machine do? Well, the Institute uses teleportation to get in and out. The Interceptor can hijack their signal and send me instead. We've spent dozens of years and too many good agents' lives only to discover not a goddamn thing. And now we have the answer, thanks to you. Teleportation? That the Institute could build something so... But we've got work to do. This is our top priority now. I want Tinker Tom to help you in any way possible to get this device built. All right. That sounds... Dez is trusting you. Promise. If you do anything to hurt my friends, I'm coming for you. Glory, right? Hey, you. You the new heavy? Bullseye, right? <sighs> yeah. Bullseye. I thought so. So the switchboard was crawling with bad guys. Mines and shit, too. Any of that true? Or was Deacon bullshitting me again? Why does no one believe Deacon? Saving sins ain't easy. So when we score a win, sometimes the propaganda gets laid on thick. Huh. How'd you take down the old HQ? Please tell me you didn't go along with Deacon's in and out like a ghost crap. There's a lot to be said about ambushing. It can save lives. Oh no, another one? Well, welcome to the party. After what happened to Tommy Whispers, we need another tough son of a bitch that can get shit done. Whispers? Tommy was the second heavy at HQ. He went KIA after the Institute assholes took out the switchboard. With him gone, I've been running missions non-stop. So I'm damn happy you're here. They call me Glory, the Angel of Death. The ass-kicking poster child of a liberated synth. Wait, so... You're a synth? That's what the maid in the Institute stamp on my ass says. So you... know them? Look, I, I've got a lot of questions about synths, the Institute. If you can tell me anything, that'd help. Every rook comes in here and wants to interrogate me. Wants to know everything about everything. I don't got the answers you want, okay? I don't know where the Institute is, how to get there. I know barely anything about them. I'm done talking. Sure. Fine. That went well. I'll let you take the lead next time. Tinker Tom, right? Yeah. Hey, uh, Tom. Don't know if you heard. Ready to hand over the plans? This is the big one. You think you can decipher these? I won't know until I get a look-see. All right. Here you go. Let's see what we need. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Who wrote this? Some kid with a crayon? Well, shit. Must have been a real big kid. Oh, man. Molecular transmission via encrypted RF waves? Those Institute eggheads are crazy. And you can divert the signal using a heavily modified relay interception. L like a pirate broadcast, you know? That's intense. I can't stress enough. There's a lot riding on this, Tom. Yeah, yeah, all right, all right. The plans cover all the high-end egghead shit, but they're missing a ton of engineering detail. Filling in the gaps will take time. This bit here, the stabilized reflector platform, just needs some high-grade metal. Easy. By the time you finish that, I'll have the rest done. So, what's it gonna take to build it then? We can scrounge up the platform components you need. No problem. But where to build it? It's gonna need some serious space. This baby's big. I know Pam was running numbers on a good site for a new safe house. It's got a workshop, good location, and the full blessings of her predictive algorithms. Once you set up the safe house, we'll drop off the materials there. Or you could build your own platform somewhere else. I guess. Your call. Pam, right? I'll check in with her and make sure it's gonna work. Where's that robot? Is that the right word? Robot? Maybe just pet. Might want to flush your system with rad away before your hair falls out. Fair enough. Where the hell? Hey, Deacon. Welcome to the family. We're a colorful and arguably insane bunch. But you're stuck with us now. 
Speaking of which, if you don't mind a sidekick, let's keep a good thing going and travel together some more. Don't they need you here? My job's mainly intel, so the more places I go, the better I'm doing it. And you are just one big beautiful distraction. Plenty of opportunities to learn secrets moving around in your shadow. I uh, appreciate that, but maybe not right now. I'll set up the workshop and check in. Maybe then. I don't know how many people this teleporter is going to be able to send, but I might just need every gun we can get. Well, if you change your mind. Sure. Use the back entrance. Too much traffic through the church and we'll burn this hideout. Back entrance. Keep that in mind. Right. Uh, Pam. Uh, a moment? Confirmed. Agent Bullseye has arrived. I have a mission for you. Without increasing efficiency of synth traffic flow, okay. parts of entire organization being compromised, increase daily. Solution. A new distribution center needs to be established. Distribution center? That the workshop? The railroad organization calls distribution centers safe houses. A place where synths are stored and then rerouted safely through the region known as the Commonwealth. Mission details commencing. Pacify the target location. Fortify position to protect current and future railroad assets. New distribution center will be codenamed Mercer Safe House. Good luck. Thanks. Mercer Safe House. All right. I'm gonna need a moment. We'll check the location and we can plan from there. All right, let's see. Okay. Mercer Station. That's a run. Yeah. Hangman's Alley. Well, you know the route. That'll make it easier. Hey, um, when you're done, Ah, we'll get going. It's our newest agent. You're the doc, right? An extraordinary feat to recover this, but that's hardly the point. Without a lick of training and us knowing hardly anything about you, Des has invited you to join HQ. It would have been nice if she had consulted with her second in command, but what's done is done. <sighs> Since you're here now, we might as well put you to work. Look, tell me what you need and. I'll see what I can do. One of our field agents, Old Man Stockton, needs help with the runaway synth, H-222. So headquarters, as always, puts out the fires that others can't be bothered to put out themselves. The paranoid old bat won't even tell us the problem. He insists that we get our intel from a dead drop. He may have a good reason to be paranoid. Perhaps he does. And maybe he did the other dozen times he's made our agents jump through these unnecessary hoops. The dead drop is a mailbox with a rail sign on it. It's a common means of communication for us, so keep an eye out for them. When you make contact with Stockton, he won't give you the time of day unless you give him the proper countersign. The current sign is, do you have a Geiger counter? And the counter is, mine is in the shop. Please tell me Deacon taught you that at least. Yeah, he told me. Look, you can trust us with this. We can get that done. Just don't bollocks it up too badly. If things go wrong, I'm the one who has to patch everyone back together. Stockton is a prominent businessman at Bunker Hill. The dead drop will be near there. Use the escape tunnel in the back to get there quicker. Bunker Hill. Yeah. Sure, Doc. Let's get a move on. Val's packed lunch. This place? Us? We don't exist. And if you say anything different... I'll keep it quiet. Don't worry. You're from one of those vaults? You got too many teeth to be a scabber. Wait. You seen other people from vaults? Word is, Diamond City is under opposition control. Yeah. Whatever. We're all the synths got. Up there, assume you're being watched. Always. I will. Thanks. Let's go.
back entrance, I suppose. Alright. Now we could go for the dead drop, but... That can wait. Safe house comes first. Sean comes first. This would be clear, right? Just in case, let's go armed. It's... messy. You know what? Looks okay. For later. Not the nicest. Seems secure. All right. Huh. Got a fusion core in there. Better not touch it. Might be hooked into their system. That's what we're after, huh? Where the heck are we? Huh. Got activity outside. By the river. Nothing there now. What do you think? I don't know. Jump in a shack. Sounds yeah, like a whole team. Right. Gotta cut down on the jet, I guess. I don't start talking crazy. Let's move quietly. <laughs> if we need to shoot, we will. Otherwise, let them pass by. <laughs> the less attention we draw, the better. No lights. All right, we're in the clear. Well, that's Bunker Hill. The alley we're looking for is not too far from Riptide. It's a boat that's moored out about halfway along the river. I don't see folks, but it doesn't mean they're not there. move. Quick, but quiet. Gunfire. Brotherhood, maybe. Eyes out for traps. Okay, so far. Docks. Quiet if we can. Dang. Lost. Over here. Come Here's on. trouble. That's that. Gunshots haven't drawn anyone yet. Keep on going. Our turn off is gonna be around the third bridge. We'll stick to the river's edge. Got 
something big ahead. Mutant, maybe. Yeah. Great. We could try and sneak past, but... I think I can get a shot with this. Let's get a little closer first. Where there's one... Someone there! Shit. That's a missile launcher. Okay. Come on. I don't think we're alone. Yeah, you don't say. Shit. Take a shot when you got one. I can smell you out there. Come on. Little sneak! Damn it. Run! Too close. <laughs> Flew right over my head. <sighs> Don't mind me. <sighs> Maybe that's what had me on edge. All right, second bridge. One more to go. That's it, I think. Yeah. We'll get closer. I'll check the map. Make sure the marker's right. Gonna be around here somewhere. Alright, let's see. Next intersection over. Yeah. Okay. This mist doesn't help. Watching a conductor at the orchestra. Hey, 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 hey. Lay off the sarcasm. Let's get this done. Yeah. Viper? Point the way. All right. I think that might have been all of them. Unless they're hiding. I think we're in the clear. Not sure if this is the spot they were talking about. 
I'll just have a look and see if we can find anything good. I got some caps and some 38. Alright. Check that pin. Yeah. This is the spot. Let's see if we can find a workbench. Somewhere we can set up this reflector platform. That might do. Yeah. Let's see if they left anything behind. Yeah. A couple of tools. Let's see if there's anything else useful on them. Then Val, I need your hand with this reflector thing. should hook up the defenses. <clears throat> uh, do, do you got a Geiger counter, bub? Huh. Sorry, mine's in the shop. Your HQ's new guy, right? Oh, th thanks for setting up this place. Kinda wish you would've set up a cot or something, but at least it's safe, right? It, it, it is safe, right? You all right? You seem a little jumpy. I I've had too many close calls. I used to work at HQ like you, but after the last HQ went lights out, I just had to get away. Enough about me. We got a package incoming. You know, package. I've, I've plotted out her escape route, got a new guy, new tourist that's gonna help. He, he, he's all ready to sign up, but he's got big problems. We clear those problems up, and our package has got a nice cozy shack to lay low in. Uh, all right. What's the Taurus problem? Oh, hell if I know. You know how it goes. The dead drop says hostels have to go bye-bye, and we, you, take care of it. I'll mark it on your map. Go there, and do what you HQ types do. Then, K-8's all set. I'll make sure she gets out of the Commonwealth. K-8. Right. Keep an eye on the place. I'm gonna need to report back to HQ. To Pam. To let her know that this is all set. Oh, there's a platform. Don't touch it. It's not active yet, but it's, um, let's just say it's proprietary tech and dangerous. So if anyone comes knocking, tell them not to touch it. Thanks. I think that's going to do it. If only it was so easy to bring them up. Secrecy and oh, lack of technology. Sky's clear. We'll head back tonight. We can rest there. I appreciate your hard work. That's no small feat. It's only the beginning. Tinker Tom should be able to handle the rest. Hey, you know we're close to that great green jewel. If you wanted to go home, you want to see your sister, I... I understand. Real sweet of you. Ain't that the truth? I don't know what I'd do without you two. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs>